I didn't know it would be this hard to try to say something. I think the easiest thing for me to say is that um, my name is Lakeisha. I am 32 years old and I have been unemployed for two years. I'm a victim of bullying. I am overweight. I have low self-esteem. I am going through depression. I don't really trust a lot of people. I don't. (laughs) I'm very antisocial and I want to change all of that. I think that's the easiest thing that I can say. In September of 2013, I decided to change my life for the better, sort of. I didn't think that anything that I was going to say was going to reach anybody else or anyone was going to pay attention to what I have to say besides. When has anyone ever listened to me and thought that I was important? Fast forward to now in 2015 and the website for Give It 100 has been changed a little bit and you cannot see the diary that I have uploaded. However, I still have the archives of everything that happened then. I've been trying to figure out what should I do with my blog and what should I say about these videos and should I explain everything because what you really don't know is that the media lied to you. They made it seem like it was all about weight loss and instead of expecting someone to get it right, I decided I'm going to do it for myself. We're going to do Behind the 100. It's going to be pretty much a collaboration of showing you what actually happened after the 10 seconds stopped. The ins, the outs, the positives, and the negatives. And more importantly, how it's not all about just losing weight. It was never all about that. Most of the people come here and they think that's what it's all about. Sorry. I was going to be real and authentic about my journey. And if you liked it, you liked it. And if you didn't, that's fine. I was in in fear of what people might say. And now I don't care. I'm going to say what I want to say. And you're probably not going to like it. You're going to hear about everything especially what happened past those 10 seconds. There are some where you're going to laugh and think that this is silly. And then there's going to be some that are going to make people mad. This is going to get ugly. I'm telling you right now. None of this is pretty. I never said that I was a quiet person, but I've been quiet for a long time for a specific reason. And I'm done being quiet.